Today we're revisiting something seen in, in the introduction. You've seen the Walter PPQ M2. T3 training for an angel fish. Walter PPQ. You got your bottom all polymer. Top slide, steel. Steel trigger. Steel slide catch. You got a rail down here. Picatinny for a laser. Torch. Um, back of the grip. Comes snapping out to rebuild your Allen wrench for your CO2. These are your magazines. These are the brain on the whole operation. Your CO2 is fed into the back here. Using that back of your um, pistol grip, that tool, the bottom of the CO2 or the magazine comes out or it comes sliding forward. Put your wrench in there. Like that. Pop this back in. Now we're all set. Got some targets set up over there. I'll get a camera going. Don't go nowhere. Your boy Brian gonna be right back. We'll take some shots of this gun. All right. Okay, guys, one thing I forgot to tell you, like I said, this gun's been reviewed and reviewed and reviewed and reviewed and reviewed and reviewed. And I've been here. It's a fun gun, though. Got to tell you, a used gun will shoot several different types of ammunition. It comes in this nice, sturdy black. Hard plastic carrying case with this foam in it. Check the gun. Comes with the squeegee. If you ever shooting paintballs out of it, you don't need this. Now, in these magazines, they're set with two different types of springs two different tensions of spring. One for your hard rubber ball and your hard ball and one for your paintball and your chop. I happen to have both my magazines at this time so we're not shooting chalk or pepper ball today. We're shooting a hard rubber ball and a 7.6 grain and these uh, 8 point they, they were 8.2 uh, roughly um, hard nylon which are these guys they call them the jawbreakers. We'll see. And we got the hard rubber, which are not real hard. The little blue rubber balls. 
I've been shot with them. They hurt. Did a video. It's on my. Go to my YouTube page. It's the first video that I'll start playing. My brother in law got to shoot me with it. With the pepper and the chalk. He didn't use any hard rubber or nylon at that time. Um, but it was effective. It was effective to immobilize me, put it that way. Um, so yeah, you want to keep in mind what spring you're using. The more FPS you use, the higher tension spring. One meant for the hard rubber and the hardened balls. Okay? We will get a camera set up over here, take some shots, okay? See how effective this gun really is. Don't go nowhere. Boy Brian will be right back. Alright, here we are. We're right back here at the range. Here. It's a beautiful day, kind of overcast a little bit. This pasture's got a little overgrown here. Just a little bit, you see. But I got me a little swath patch. Uh, I got out here with the weed eater, did as much as I possibly could. Just to cut down about 25 yards for me to shoot. Today we're talking about my friend right here. Got to be as far as air pistol, CO2 pistol. That works flawless on me. Has never failed me. This gun, the CO2 pistol, actually mobilized me. The chalk and the pepper balls put me down. Yeah, they put me down. So, that being said, that being shown on video, um, yeah, and we're going to show the effectiveness of this once again. Um, like I said, I showed you the hardened nylon balls. Those are the most re recent rounds I was able to uh, appear. And the hard rubber balls. Now I got some targets set up down here. And we're going to pop them off. We'll shoot the hard rubber balls first, then go on to the nylon and see what happens. Okay? So hang in there. Once again, I'll be right back with you. Okay. We'll load up the Walter PPQ with, uh, we have, I don't know if you can make that out. We got the blue hardened rubber balls in here first. Okay, I'm going to shoot at the bottom ram. Shoot at the top ram.
Okay, so let's shoot the can. The hard rubber blue balls. And the glass. Okay, so we shot the rubber balls. They did okay on the little targets. I only put a dent in the uh, tank can, did nothing to the glass. Alright, hard nylon balls next. These guys, they call them the jawbreakers. That's what eBay called them anyway. Not eBay, Amazon. Um, you see what these nylon balls do, okay? All right, we're gonna be shooting at the little target first. Rocket. All right, a little ram. History. Nope. There he goes. There he goes. Now the tin can. Oh, brutal. Now the glass bottle. Jawbreakers, I believe it. Ha! <laughs> hey! The Walter PPQ M2 T4E training for engagement pistol. All this thing. You just seen what it did to that glass Coke bottle. This is no joke. These things are no joke. Yeah. Until next time, listen, hit that like button for us. Do us a favor, become part of the family. Subscribe to the channel. Be a supporter of this channel for us. Help us see us grow and thrive. God bless you. This is Brian from Our Red Chair Gun Fun Channel. Until next time.